What's up, everybody? Jay's here for Jaspies eBay, presented by our website, jaspiescasebreaks.com. Check it out. Uh, last break of the night, 2019 Gold Rush Trifecta Memorabilia Baseball Box Case Break number one. So, as you can see, that's kind of hard to see, though. There's the Trifecta. So, we sold it as random teams, guys. Uh, this is a case. I believe there is three items per box, per case. Um, what well, could be autographed gloves, autographed bats, not bats, I believe, but autographed gloves, uh, signed photos, jerseys, all different memorabilia, as you can see on uh, the photo that we shared with you guys on eBay. Um, obviously, there is no checklist since it is a pretty much a repack buyback type of product. Um, but yeah, there's jerseys, photos, unique equipment helmets, you know, stuff like that, baseballs, pop, cleats, maybe, who knows. Uh, helmets uh, there's a lot of different stuff of course um, so yeah of course uh, just to let you guys know uh, whatever photo whatever team is on the photo is where it's gonna go to uh, the autographed jerseys they may be authentic they may be replicas but of course uh, uh, unless it's an all-star jersey uh, if of course it's like let's say uh, a green Maguire jersey well we're obviously gonna know of course with the, the style of the jersey, it's gonna be obviously going to the Oakland Athletics. Of course, unless it's anything all-star, if it's like an all-star photo, um, all-star helmet, something crazy like that, then of course that's when our college rules will apply, where if it's non-MLB, it'll go to the team they're currently on or the team they played for the longest. So depending on that, so of course, uh, if the equipment has an Angels helmet, then it's gonna to go to the Angels. So anything unless it's like that. So let's quickly open up the box, guys. here guys I want to make sure that I keep that side box open Actually. All right. we'll take out this paper as you can see all right and then we'll go with the baseball first so it looks like we got a baseball here there is the name of the player right here, but I want to show you the baseball. So again, if it's autographed baseball, it's not going to have a team logo, so it's going to go to the team that they're on currently, or if they're retired, the team they played for the longest. So here you go. Here's the JSA. And anybody recognize this autographed baseball before I show the sticker? Hall of Fame 2000 inscription. I think it's pretty, pretty easy to figure that out, right? There's the JSA right there. Yes, Joe Pizzo, you got it right. And yes, it is Carlton Fisk. There you go. So again, no MLB logo, no anything like that. Autograph baseball, that means it'll go to the team he's currently on or if retired, team he played for the longest. And looking at Carlton Fisk on baseball reference, played, ooh, no. 13 years with the Chicago White Sox, only 11 with the Boston Red Sox. Played for 24 years, wow. So yeah, obviously he did start off his career with the Boston Red Sox, but then played 13 straight years with the White Sox. I mean, only played for two teams, so it's either one or the other, right? Of course, if there was a tiebreaker in years, it'll go by games played. So he did play for more games with the White Sox as well. So that'll be going to the Chicago White Sox, and I don't have the list ready for here, but let's check it out. Let's see who has the Chicago White Sox. Matt Singler, or Sigler, actually has the White Sox in trifecta, so there you go. White Sox. I'll put a little uh, little post-it note on this. All right, 
right, there you go. White Sox. Next one. You got an autographed jersey, number 48. Anybody recognize that number or signature? Well, I don't know why I flipped it. <laughs> Jacob DeGrom. Mets. An officially licensed jersey. There you go. Look at that. Very, very nice. Actually legit. And it's a size extra large, even if you did want to wear it. So there you go, Mets. Put it back in here as neat as possible. Make sure the autograph doesn't get smudged. There you go. New York Mets with that one. And let's see who has the Mets really quick. Richard Zitterman actually has the Mets, so there you go. And the last one, guys, is actually something nice. Just show you guys the empty box. Let's actually put the items back, guys. Well, let's see what this is. Look at this, guys. Jeez. Oh, man. <laughs> Turn this over here, guys. So there's a lot of authenticity. Who we may concern. Baltimore Oriole greats multi sign autographs with 30 signatures. Wow, look at that! Can you guys recognize all these signatures? Baltimore, it's gonna go to Baltimore, guys. I don't know if it says. Any notable signatures? Oh, so Harold Baines and Bog Powell. This is pretty awesome. Look at that. Obviously, there's a lot of other notable signatures that I may not know of, actually. But still pretty cool. Pretty cool hit right there, guys. And that'll be a little horn right there for you guys. Who has the Baltimore Orioles? the Baltimore Orioles in Gold Rush Trifecta. Nice. There you go. Congratulations. And there you go, guys. Again, it's a big hit or miss type of break. Only three items. We had the 30 signature multi-signed Baltimore Orioles uh, players. 
We have a Jacob DeGrom Mets officially licensed autographed jersey. And a Carlton Fisk autographed baseball that will be going to the White Sox. So, again, only three items, guys. So, of course, uh, 30 MLB teams, three teams only hitting. So, of course, the rest of you guys, the 27 other teams that went hitless, we will be sending out a pack of baseball cards. Hopefully, you get some autographs, relics, stuff like that in there. And, again, appreciate you guys shopping with us here at Jaspies eBay, jaspiescasebreaks.com. We'll see you guys.